I'm Ernest Inslee with The Sting, and this is... Kevin White, SJA President. And we're going to discuss some of the issues um, regarding the new Marksmanship Club. Um, first of all, I would like to know, how, what are your thoughts about the new Marksmanship Club in general? Um, I think it's, I know, all organizations or clubs that kind of get SJA approved are good. They, they start off with good intentions. Um, so, you know, when he, he presented his information, I think that he did a, a great job of kind of letting us know that, you know, we're not here to kind of advocate for any political measures, but we're here to kind of knock off the stigma that guns are bad or, you know, guns can be misused. So uh, his intent is to, you know, get people comfortable with guns, and I think that's a, that's a good start, um, starting an organization for that. Okay, on that note, um, do you have any reservations about safety or responsibility re regarding firearms and students? You know, firearms and students is a big, big subject now. Border Regents is actually going really back and forth about um, guns on campuses, administrators carrying guns. I think any organization that sole purpose is to, you know, get people more comfortable with guns, you know, they said they were setting up classes or go attend classes that kind of get people comfortable with gun safety, then it's always great. You know, guns have that stigma. I mean, they can take a life. So I think to, to get people to know how to really use it, and maybe that knocks off some of the stigma and that gets people more comfortable about the situation. Um, we don't know what's going to come of it, um, of the border regions kind of, or the Senate or the legislation that's coming from it. So I think that anything to get people more comfortable around it would be good. Okay, and um, how do you think this will affect the student body, this, this presence of this new marksmanship club on campus? No, hopefully it makes them aware. You know, sometimes students, you know, they hear it in passing. They're like, oh, it'll never happen, or oh, I hope it does happen, you know. But maybe this makes them aware. Maybe, you know, they say, okay, there, there is a comfortable group of students who maybe they have concerns with guns, but maybe, you know, we want to get more comfortable, but I never had to go with a set of friends who could, kind of coach me through. It's always awkward going into a new place by yourself, like a, especially a gun store. So maybe you can go to a set of friends and you learn those safety measures with your friends and it becomes a hobby. So I think anything, anytime you start looking at something dangerous, uh, for example, like MMA and it becomes a hobby, mm -hmm. you know, it kind of knocks off some of the, the chill of it all. So I think it's a good start. All right. Could you fill us in on some of the updates with the SGA? All right. So, um, this semester has been pretty busy for SGA. We're actually um, still in the process of kind of editing and compiling, um, formatting our updated constitution. Um, we approved that last November maybe, so uh, we're about a week away from finishing that. Um, we just finished up accepting fiscal budgets through OrgSync, so for the last two and a half weeks we've been sending out emails and reminders, um, just making sure that we can get as many organizations as possible to kind of request funds because we would like to kind of sponsor and get as many people active on campus. Um, we also are in the process of evaluating candidates for upcoming positions for the next year, which is 2013-2014 um, SGA season. So we just got those applications. We're going through uh, making sure that everyone's qualified, they all meet the kind of minimum qualifications. And uh, once we email those students, we'll start going through forums, we'll be posting videos, um, and we'll start getting the SGA season, uh, election season underway. So right now that's where we are, and I hope that it all kind of finishes up on a good note. Thank you. Good luck. And this has been Ernest Inslee with the Sting.